What's up everyone, Leon Petri here. In this video, I'm gonna show you how you can turn any YouTube video into a PowerPoint presentation, literally by clicking one button and it generates it in less than two minutes. Gamma was able to build a API which allows you to build apps or automations to generate presentations just by using their API. And if you don't know what an API is, don't worry, it's not that complicated. And I'm gonna show you step-by-step step how you can set this all up so that you can also convert YouTube videos into PowerPoint presentations. So the way we do this is with this make.com automation, all right? So there's a few steps here. First, you enter a YouTube URL link, all right? Then it scrapes the transcript of that video using a software called Superdata. Then it uses Gamma to generate the presentation and then it returns a PowerPoint file. Let me do a little demo. I'll come to my YouTube channel and let me find a random video. I will copy the link to this video, which is as Transformers Explained, understand the model behind ChatGPT. I'll come here and I will paste that in and I will choose how many slides I want. Let's just keep it to 11 slides, okay? And it must structure it as a step-by-step -step tutorial and it's targeted towards white collar working professionals. All right, so that's good. Let's click run. And so you can see it just scraped the transcript. Now it generated the gamma or the presentation. Okay, now we're just waiting for it to make sure that it's fully rendered and then it will return the final PowerPoint. So while this is generating, I'm just gonna come here to gamma and I will refresh this, right? So there will be your dashboard over here and you can see here it is GPT in a nutshell. It's busy uh, generating right now. And let's come back here. It's almost done. And there you go, it just finished running. Okay, so if we come and open up this last module, uh, we can scroll down to our output, click on data, and then the export URL, you'll see there's a .pptx, which is a PowerPoint presentation. So we can simply copy that and paste it in a new tab, and that will then download the file. It's busy downloading that PowerPoint presentation. Right, so it finished downloading, so let's open that up. And here it is. Let me come to slideshow and play from the start. And here is the presentation that it generated. And you can see it followed the step-by-step -step instructions, and you can see it converted my video into a very engaging, a beautifully structured uh, PowerPoint presentation. And if I want, I can always just come and just change whatever text I wanna change. Then it would also save in your Gamma application. So if I open this up, here is a whole presentation and you can also come here and if you wanna change something like that should be 1.75 billion or whatever, then you can just come and make your changes. You can also change your theme to whatever you like, let's say you want a light theme, you can go with Pearl and it'll then change the theme as well. All right, so I'm gonna show you now exactly how you can set this up and it's super quick and super easy. And I've made it super quick and easy because I actually provide you with a template. So uh, you can go to futurize.com, which is my free automation community. Then you can go to templates. Okay, then simply just search the term YouTube like that and then just filter for the make automations and then it'll be this one here convert youtube video to powerpoint presentation open that one up and then click on download template it is free to sign up and download this template and there will also be the links over here that you can use to sign up to make.com gamma and superdata which are used to build this automation okay so to actually import that into make.com okay you would come create a scenario here you then click more import blueprint choose file, then select the scenario blueprint, click save. Now, the only things you need to change here is the values inside of this first module over here, as well as the API key for Superdata and the API key for Gamma. It's very simple to get all of those. So I'll start with the API key for Superdata. So um, you can simply just come here, click on Superdata, and that should take you to the documentation. Once you're here, you wanna click on dashboard, okay? And it will probably prompt you to sign up. Once you've signed up, you wanna click on API keys on the left here, click create API key. So you don't need to worry about paying for the software. It will be free as long as you're scraping less than 100 YouTube videos, which is 100 PowerPoint presentations per month. 
So we can give it a name. You can call it YouTube video scraper. All right, I misspelled that, but it's fine. Create, then you just copy that key, all right, by clicking that button. Come back here, open up your super data module, click add, and then uh, the API key, you wanna paste that in over there. Okay, so there is my API key. You wanna keep this a secret. You don't wanna share that with anyone, then click save. So that's done. I will then click on save. The second thing you need to do is get your gamma API key. So you can go to gamma.app, okay? And I've already created an account and you will need to be on the pro plan. So let me just show you quickly. If you go to pricing, you'll see that the API access is only available on their pro plan. If you switch this over to the monthly plan, that would be $25 per month. So this is a plan that I'm currently on. Now with this plan, you will get about 4,000 credits per month. And to generate one 10 page PowerPoint presentation will cost you around 40 credits. So if you do the math, that will be around 100 PowerPoint presentations that you can generate per month. Uh, so that corresponds nicely with the super data free tier. So for just $25 per month, you'll be able to generate 100 PowerPoint presentations. And then you can always top up with credits later on if you want. So once you've signed up to Gamma, you can come to settings and members, then go to API keys and then click create API key and then type in uh, whatever YouTube to presentation, whatever you want to call it, click create API key and then copy that key and then come back to make.com and then open up generate a gamma module and then scroll down to the value of this API key. So you just want to replace my one, delete that and then control V to paste in your new API key. Right, and then I'll click save, there you go. Then let's say for instance, you wanted to have maybe a larger presentation. So we can say, instead of 11 slides, we can make that, I don't know, 20 slides. The maximum you can do is 50, which is quite a lot. Let's even go more, let's go 30 slides. And then instructions for the presentation. As so you can see, I said structure as a step-by-step -step tutorial. I will just say used as university lecture slides. And then who's the audience? We can say something like beginners to AI in a computer science 101 degree or course who don't have any background knowledge in this topic. Theme name, then here you can choose the theme of the presentation slides. So if you come to Gamma, let me just close that and you go to themes, then just click on standard. You'll see all the off the shelf themes that you can choose from. All right, let's say you want this flamingo theme, you would just copy that word flamingo. So this is what it would look like. That looks pretty nice. So let's just go with that flamingo and then click save. All right, now that's all set up. Let's test this out and make sure it works. So we click run once. Okay, so it's finished running. Let's go to uh, open it up in Gamma. So let me just close this theme, go to Gammas and here it is. So I'll open that up. So here it is, automated Twitter content creation with GPT 4.5, and there it is. That's pretty cool. All right, did a great job. Now you might be wondering how I set up the actual API for the Gamma API over here. These are all the parameters that I configured. So if you wanna see the details of what all of these different parameters mean, you can see that in the Gamma documentation. So if you go to the Gamma website and then go to the API, you can then click on view documentation, then click on API reference, and then under generate a gamma, here are all the different parameters and what all of them mean, right? And you can actually set all the values over here and it will configure the whole JSON string for you that you can just come here and copy this and then paste it back into make.com. If you want more details on how to set up the actual API and how to set up this whole entire workflow, I have created an entire course setting all of this up step by step. So not only do you learn how to build this automation, but you'll just get a better understanding on how to build automations with Make. And that will be uh, hosted here in my Futurized community. If you go to courses and you go to this Become a Make Pro, you click go to course and the course will be included over there. So that's all for this video. I hope it was helpful. If it was, please like the video, subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you in the next.